hey guys welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new on today's video i'm going to be styling a classic white t-shirt which is also a basic you guys know i style basics on my channel so today's video is no different i'm gonna be styling a white t-shirt like i've already said and most of the stuff that i'm gonna be styling my shirt with are also basic so it will be quite easy for you guys to recreate those looks at home if you kind of draw inspiration from what i'm going to be showing you if you haven't subscribed please do i'd really really appreciate that and if you enjoy this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up without wasting any more time let's get to the styling portion of the video so this is the shirt that I'm going to be styling. As you can see, it's more of like a slouchy t-shirt. It has a pocket detailing in front. It's very casual, so it's kind of easy to dress down as well. For the first look, I am pairing the skirt with an orange midi skirt. Uh, my camera quality is not that great, but this is made of wool material and it's ribbed, so it's very comfy and you can wear it in winter as well. So for the first look, as you can see, I'm giving you guys two looks. The first look with, uh, I'm carrying a blue bag for the high contrast effect. I'm also wearing high heels because this is more of like a nighttime kind of look. And I'm tying the shirt in front just to make it look a little bit more relaxed than the other look. For the other look, I I'm just pairing it with a crop denim shirt, uh, a crop denim jacket rather, and a pair of trainers carrying a white crossbody bag. So this next look is very much inspired by the 80s or was it the 70s? Yeah, I'm pairing the shirt with the flat bottom pants as well as chunky heels and a red beret. I'm carrying this black mini bag which I got from this other shop that sells uh, Shein clothes here in South Africa. So I think you can get this from Shein if you're not here in SA. So yeah. I kind of really love this look because it's giving me vintage vibes even though I didn't wear my beret properly but you can kind of see what I was going for here so yeah. So the next look is the classic look. It's very versatile. It's easy to dress up and dress down this dynamic duo. I am pairing my white shirt with a pair of mom jeans as well as the same accessories I used on my previous look which are the chunky high heels as well as a mini bag. But here on this look I'm carrying it as a crossbody because I was going for the more relaxed look. The high heels makes it look put together and I tucked my shirt on the side just so I can show off the slouchiness of the jeans so yeah the nice thing about these uh, jeans and a shirt is that it's versatile you can wear it in any season with any accessory so for this next look, I am giving you a white vibes. I'm pairing my white shirt with white skinny jeans as well as flat ballerinas and their beige. I'm also carrying a beige bag that matches my shoes and I'm wearing a crop denim jacket on top just so I can break off that all white monochrome vibe. So yeah. So for this next look, I'm wearing the shirt underneath my backless dress. As you guys can see, this dress exposes everything. It has a very low neckline and it has a, a slit in front. The back, like I said, is open. So I wear the shirt underneath just to have some parts of mine covered. I don't mind showing off my body, but I don't want to show off everything at the same time. So for this look, the leg will do just fine. I'm carrying my crossbody bag, but I'm carrying it as a clutch. As you can see, it's cream and I'm wearing a pair of wide high heels and the shirt gives it a high contrast effect which i think really photographs well so yeah that's the look for the final look i'm wearing my shirt with a pair of white shorts and they have a raw hemline and i'm wearing my strappy sandals carrying the blue bag that i carried i think this would have looked perfect with a straw bag but i didn't have one when i was shooting and i am wearing a head which is so small or maybe my head is just big this head only fits me when i don't have a wig underneath so yeah hence it looks the way it does and yeah that's just about it the moral of the story here is that you can wear your watch it with just about anything so yeah that's it thank you guys for watching 